Hey guys, welcome. Arthur. This is the debut, hopefully, of the brand new Let's Play series over on my channel. Today, guest starring, you, know, you can't see him, because one doesn't have a webcam, and the other one, I don't really don't know how to screen size share on OBS yet, is your favorite, Stick1990. And his and new friend TV <coughs> Havoc. <coughs> Say hi, guys. Mother God. That's a great introduction right there. Mother of God. <laughs> that was beautiful. Oh my God. Yeah, that was my introduction. I'm playing a game right now, so and I, and I'm sucking on a cough drop because I was really sick about two days ago yesterday too though i was starting to recover yesterday and now i've recovered a bit more but now i still have a nasty little cough that's not as pronounced but anytime i cough my chest hurts so that's not good and you can see pvc havoc over on his channel with his project reality game oh i've also got a whole bunch more coming i've got a, a new insurgency video up today uh, gonna be doing Borderlands, Borderlands 2, the entire Bioshock trilogy, Kerbal Space Program, as always. How you playing the Bioshock trilogy? I'm playing them straight through from beginning to very end, 100%. I mean, like, no, like, what system? Are you playing the HD collection that came out recently, or are you playing the originals? Yeah, the, the remastered, the remastered, yeah. Yeah, I want to I wanna get the HD collection, but they, it hasn't gone on sale yet. Well, the wonderful thing is, is if you bought it as a bundle from uh, Humble Bundle, you get the uh, remastered free. Oh. Well, I know the Steam version you get for nothing if you owned them, but yeah. um, I, I'm not, I want the PS4 version. Ah, uh, gotcha. Well, when you're running a system like I am, uh, there's no need to get any other game system whatsoever. Yeah, I don't care. Like, I, I got all God. the... I got I got the kick butt graphics. I got the kick butt everything. 16 I gigs. I would imagine PC. Yeah. It can be yeah. mega machine. Yeah. <laughs> More killer tomatoes. What the hell? Oh, right. be dead. Never mind that. That's use a hundred <laughs> cheat. Fine, fine. Anyways, we'll, we might as well get turned to the game now because we've been talking. We are playing Final Fantasy VII, the remix edition. Final we, Fantasy V11. <laughs> the remix edition because I've already played this game on my on my channel a few years ago, but it's unfinished. So it's time to finish it. It's the best way to do it. I don't like leaving projects unfinished. Are we sure this is Final Fantasy VII, though? Knowing how the Final yeah. Fantasy games get released differently, is this Final Fantasy VII, or is this, are we going to find out that this is actually Final Fantasy XLIII? It's no, like when I found out that Final Fantasy... Set. No, to me it's Final Fantasy V2. Uh, it's like I remember finding out that Final Fantasy 3 was not actually Final Fantasy 3. They lied to me. It was yeah, that. Oh. Man, you remember that jarring thing? And that happened, right? What jarring thing? You remember that jarring thing when it happened, right? Oh, yeah. Space. The Final Frontier. These are the. Vandalia, you remember of how. The Starship Final Enterprise Fantasy. is oh, ongoing yeah, yeah, yeah. missions. To explore a strange new world, to seek out new life and new civilizations, to boldly go where no one has gone before. To Midgar! <laughs> Alright, more killer to me, this shit. 
Uh, all right. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh, oh my god. Of course not. Not the first character you're introduced to. Never. I'm so glad that the Final Fantasy series didn't play out like a Game of Thrones series. You start playing and about five chapters in, everybody you cared about is dead. Wow. Trivia fact, this is the first Final Fantasy game to be set in modern day. So I'm pretty sure you already knew that. I can't even remember 1990. I was... I was... I was already out of high school, and my first son was already born. What about you? Me? Yeah. I was still in diapers. <laughs> Come on, come here. Follow me. No stranger. Ranger danger. Ranger danger. Show me on the pixels where the bad camera angle touched you. God, I do not miss those things. <laughs> and I have it. I have it sped up. Somehow. You know how I did it. Oh god, yeah. I remember playing it on the original PlayStation. All seven damn discs of it. How to get soldier now? Oh, yes. I was a soldier. I was in Soldier. That is the truth. I am not lying at all. This, this is back when Square Enix didn't actually have a clue on how to name anything properly, and I seriously believe that they just had this giant board of squares with random nouns in it, just through darts. Yeah, Vanthelia, what was your... Did you play Final Fantasy in its old days? Yeah, I played 7 on the PC. Did you, did you remember how jarring it was for like, you know how 2 and 3 didn't get released in the US, but then 4 did, but then they renamed 4 2 here in the US to avoid confusion, and then they did the same for 6 when they skipped over 5 and they called it 6 3. And then they called 7. But then when 7 came out, they just. And then when 7 came out, they just kept the title of 7. I'm pretty sure that confused a lot of people. But then. Oh, Mr. T. Because of Final Fantasy, I firmly believe that my entire childhood is a lie. I'm not, I'm not even sure which Final Fantasy the Final Fantasies I've played. Is it three? Uh, I've played three. all of them. I've only beaten three of them. Uh, what is this circle? Yeah, I, I've played every single one of the. Uh, U.S. released Final Fantasy games and beat them all. I even, I even for a while had a Final Fantasy Online account. Oh, I was 
so do I. I I haven't played FF uh, 11 online for a while. I remember when these graphics were like top of the line, everybody was astonished by it. Yeah, I read mean, this forum. It's the it's, 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 it's joke I read before. I went to it. But, but, you, you just can't. You can't kind of bring about how these new graphics are terrible. You just have a little ball and all this stuff. And some older guy was like, hey, try playing Atari with a regular Nintendo. It's got the same turn out. Play, play some original pitfall. That's what I started my kids on. Uh, I, I'd say all of my kids, pretty much their favorite game was the uh, was Bubble Mama on the NES. Little dragons blowing bubbles, popping people, collecting food. I remember my very first video game of all time. That was on the Candy Color Computer 2, and it was Temple of Ra. And oh my god, that was the most annoying video game ever. Frogger was at least playable. Temple of Rom isn't. Temple of Rom is similar to uh, E.T. on the original Atari. Whatever, dude named Wedge. The great name. Guarantee he didn't get picked on. This is like the Yeah. Well, of course. Okay, so in this game, fans get blood, and Kingdom Hearts fans get hearts. It's a whole circular system now. I wonder what the code is. The code probably like one. I don't wanna. My, my fat forearms aren't capable of pushing buttons. Somebody else has to do it for me. Not my problem, but yep. Push the button. Thanks for screw up. All life's being gray. Yeah, that'll be good. Yeah, Cloud doesn't care. Not my problem. Planet's dying, Cloud. I don't care. I just want to finish my job and do something about my future. Yeah, but there were also too many uh, RPGs out there at that time that didn't have random battles, that had a cap limit on the experience you could gain, and if you don't, didn't play it. Right. 
Having just enough random battles that you didn't really have to find. Alex Liff, our ledge, our own factory, our own I would love to be in Cloud's head when somebody's telling him, you need to press X to climb a ladder, and he's just standing there thinking to himself, what the hell are you people talking about? What X? What direction buttons? That's why they're the bad guys. You know, it doesn't have. You know, I, I don't care if it's you know the backstory of the character that you think is amazing, or the move set, or the their potential from the game itself. Hmm. Whatever it may be, what is your favorite? Well, I think I like uh, Tifa for her limit breaks because she's the only one in the camera can do all the breaks in a row. Everyone else has to choose their limit breaks. Like, oh, this one is this one. She does them all. How about you, Schnick? How about me? Yeah, they were well, obviously Southern Gear. Well, obviously, Sid, because he's the most potty mouth Final Fantasy character ever featured in the series. I have always loved Red 30. Why? Because he looked the most bad. Uh, he's even on the back of the box. Yes. I mean, he was... He was, like, completely different from every other character. Every other character was, you know, it's a human-like female or a 
human-like male. Oh, he's got some android parts, but it's still, it's humanoid. Red 13 comes along, and he was just badass. All around badass. Now, there have been characters throughout the entire Final Fantasy series that have been other races. Final Fantasy, uh, Final Fantasy 7, Red 13, he was just, he looked kick ass. Uh, well, we'll, we'll do this next time as we, as, as we, as, as next episode, we're gonna blow up the factory. Twins do. See y'all next time, and remember, enjoy the randomness. <coughs> bye bye.